Hey guys, welcome back. Shut to up. Shut up. I'm excited. Hi, this is Trisk at Squid King with. With what? With, with me. you. With me. Okay. Yes. You're yelling at me. I this don't is... care. I'm excited. This is. We are blessed by the Lord, Gaben. This is Neon. Uh, yeah. There's there's a new half. I'm so excited. It's a new Half Life game coming out, and Squid King's uh, pretty excited. Excited. So, um, I haven't seen all the trailer. I know there were rumors that Half Life Three was coming. This is not Half Life Three. This is like Half Half Life One Point Five. One Point Five takes place between the first and second game. Um. I'm so, so excited. Here's your first look. It's coming. This is going to be in VR. I'm so um, excited. So you're just going to see these floating hands. Yep. Um, this is, of course, Half-Life Alex. Mm-hmm. Would you like to explain to people who Alex is? If they Alex know? is a character from Half-Life 2. She's like post-apocalyptic Laura Croft. There you go. There That's you go. the best explanation I can give. All right. So Squid King, it is, it is very fitting that this comes out now because Squid King has a holiday tradition. I binge play all of Half-Life 2. Every Thanksgiving, from Thanksgiving through Christmas? Yes. Yes, every year. For how many years now? Uh, like three. Three years? Yes, this is his This is his holiday tradition. He plays through Half-Life 1 and 2. Um, because there isn't a Half-Life 3. But now there's going to be Half-Life 1.5. So next next year... Well, first we're going to have to buy a VR for yeah, computer. Okay, is that but that, I mean, you're going to have to buy it. Because I don't have a disposable income. It's okay. So we'll have to get we'll have to get Squid King a a, a, a Half Life Alex fund or something going here. All right. So we're gonna watch and react uh, to this trailer. You've already seen it what like nineteen or twenty times. Yeah, something like that. Something you know in the ballpark of double digits probably. Because I'm like watching. It's like oh head crabs. I know them. And you're yeah. like oh my god. Yeah. I'm like head head crabs. Cool. That's an accurate representation. Yeah. I I saw the trailer and my very first reaction. Well, first it was a lack of airflow it was kind of like <laughs> <laughs> it turns out it was a prank it oh, would be so I'd kill fun. someone wouldn't it be funny no it would not be funny. comes out comes out on april 1st mm -hmm. no it doesn't no it doesn't there is no new half-life game never 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 but there is yes all right here we go oh deep breathing <sighs> so it looks really good for a vr game it does it does um it, it's really impressive, and I want to point this out. Uh, the way the bucket moves, that's incredible. Head that, crab. Alex? That's oh, where I was like, hey. So excited. Head, head crab, so cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so this looks... There's no oh, 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 yeah. Find a way out. Got it. I'm with so, you every step of the way. Really quick. Uh, I'm pausing. I'm pausing. You, you know he's going to die because you never hear about him in any of the main games. I feel like he's about to get Rogue one Probably. 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 Like, this character cannot live past this game because... Nope. You know, this is the best part of the trailer. And that's a lie. I, I, no, I saw this part. The trailer is the best part of the trailer. I thought this was pretty cool. I thought this was hilarious. This is funny. Don't worry, it's unloaded. It's unloaded. It's unloaded now. <laughs> oh, gravity hands. Gravity gloves. And this looks really awesome. Oh, I love the, uh, oh, first and foremost, them physics, though. I love the new design for the Combine Soldiers. I love it. It's super, like, kind of like retro sci-fi-y. It looks kind of Fallout. Yeah, uh, kind, kind of, of Fallout. And they have like the giant structures, all the power lines. Oh, it looks so cool. Yeah. So this isn't. This isn't. Uh, is this after the war? The Seven Hour War. Yeah. Yes, I'm assuming yeah, okay. it's probably like a couple years after. Okay. So that that's going to be the next game. We're just going to go backwards. Yeah. Getting the Lost Planet find treatment. Out what he knows, and then oh, that looks so come. good. All oh, this is my fault. I never told you. I couldn't. I'm so sorry. Oh, it looks so good. You will not save him. Alex Bamsolo cannot prevent his fate. Close your eyes, honey! No, there's more. Keep going. I'm just... just I'm putting this on the screen so you can see. This is a legit new Half-Life game. 
Yeah, if you this couldn't not, already tell. This is not an optical illusion. Nobody really knew this was coming. Nope. Well, they kind of did. Like, there were rumors about a Half-Life VR game for like a couple of years now. Yeah. And people are like, they're not going to do it. It's Valve. They're probably just going to be like, here's your Half-Life card game, guys. Here's your here's your Half-Life um Half-Life MMORPG top-down MOBA game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, pay to play. And no, it's this. And then here's the best part of the trailer. Uh-oh, I know that guy. Mm-hmm. Everybody knows that guy. What's his name? I don't know. It's Steve, Dad. It's Steve. It's Steve? No, it's G-Man. But... I knew it wasn't Steve! <laughs> it just... Uh-oh, it's tell... the greatest mystery of all time. Who is Steve? Well, I knew it was cheap. I'm like, I don't know his actual name. Do they... Interdimensional demon warlock or accountant? The world may never know. Uh, he's the uh, cigarette smoking man. I think. But uh, yeah. So um, yeah, new Half-Life game. Pretty cool. We're going to yeah. play it, right? Yeah, we are. We're going to play it. Is that what we're going to do? We're going to go. We're going to go Fun buy. fact. Uh, Valve Index owners are going to get this for free. That's what I heard. I don't know if it's true. I'm pretty sure it is. Otherwise biggest letdown of the century so does valve have to bring this out one to prove that they still make games uh i I think so now for me the thing i'm most excited about with this game apart from the fact that it looks amazing is that it shows that valve is still making half-life games or just games in general i think they're feeling the pinch from epic i think you might be right i think that you know if it wasn't so maybe maybe we have Fortnite to thank for half-life returning oh don't go there I'm just putting that out there. That's like being like, oh, cancer saved grandma. No, cancer <laughs> killed grandma. <laughs> um, well, not if you think about it and twist the logic a little bit. So yeah, there we go. Uh, new Half Life game coming. Um, we'll have to. We'll have to get. Do you want to do that fun thing we do where we go scene by scene? Because I want to go scene by scene really bad. Okay. There we go. Okay. There's a couple things I want to point out. All Check right. Hands you off the mouse. Go. You're in my town now, boy. All right. So, right here, there's a little funny little creature. Let's put this in super slow-mo. All of that slow-mo. Okay, ready? Oh, nope, I went too far. Oh! Oh, that's completely new. I thought it was a little glowy head crab, but no, that it's is like... No, like, it's like a... Like a manta ray. It's like a manta ray crawling on the ground, yes. Oh, that's cool. Yes, that's kind of weird. Ooh, wait. Is that a Stuka bat? Oh. That was a cut enemy from the Half-Life 1. Oh. Mm-hmm. Can I pull up a picture? Okay, and we are here, and I think I'm right. It maybe, but it's got like a tail like a manta ray. Well, yeah, I guess it Well, it does. looks, it has like, it has the tail, and then it has little legs. Yeah, but it looks like it has more something going on. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Oh, well, let's keep going. Let us continue. Okay, what else did I want to look at? Well, this obviously, so they're clearly building the Citadel. Mm. Very excited about that. It looks awesome. Okay, that's about all I can do. Appreciate that. Let's see. uh, They had these cool little, like, puzzle things, maybe? Oh, God, I hate puzzles. I just like to blow stuff up. Uh, no idea who this guy is, but we know he's probably gonna die. Probably. He's I'm... with you every step, except the steps taken in Half-Life 2. Because he's gone. It looks like here, you get your magical gravity gloves. Replacing yeah. the gravity gun. And you can see him here. Look at this. Oh yeah, look. Boom. There you go. Gravity gloves. Incredible. Boom. That's cool. Now, I really wanted to look up at when it starts flashing things, because every trailer has to do that. Let's see. It looks like you're going through a decrepit building. That's some true Half-Life stuff. Mm -hmm. Old, smashed buildings. Uh, It looks like a really awesome stealth section, maybe? It looks like 
Now, I really want to know what she hits him with. A box. A box? She hits him with a box, and it explodes in the pack of peanuts, peanuts. And then his brain explodes. You have to push bodies aside. Ooh, this looks like Zen. It's not Zen, but it looks like Zen. And what's that in the middle? Ew, it's like a little tentacle. I just want to really quick appreciate how good this looks. Because it looks really good. It does look Like, good. visually, it looks incredible. Well, they've had, what, like, freaking, how many years? 10 years? 12 years? 12 years. 12 years? 2007 was the last game. They've had 12 years I just, to work on. I really want to point out that this looks like Zen. I don't think it is Zen, but it looks like it. And there's this weird thing going on. Yeah. I have a strong feeling this is going to be Vortigaunt related. Hmm. You will not save him. That looks awesome. This looks cool, whatever's going on here. Just straight up steel stuff. Okay, the zombies in this look really cool. They do. They look incredible. They do. Their their guts are you know sufficiently it, realistic. Yeah, you know what it looks like? Like Resident guts. Evil 7. Kind of, yeah. Yeah, yeah it does. It's nice exactly. and juicy. Yeah, it look like that pale skin. Yeah. Oh, they look so awful, and I love it. This is just weird. I have no idea what's happening here. It looks like a zombie kind of roped up in a weird fleshy sewer. Yeah, it looks like, like tentacles or some sort of organics are connected to this person. Hey. This is just weird. Don't really... Don't really know what's happening here. Antlions are back, and they look awesome. Looks like you can blow their limbs off, too, because nothing says fun quite like dismemberment. Damn. It's not a good time till the legs are flying off. Clap, clap. <laughs> and then the last shot of the trailer, and arguably one of the most impressive, whatever that is. That's a spaceship. Yeah, it's a spaceship. Spaceship. Or interdimensional spaceship. ship or something. Interdimensional, probably, because the Combine ship. have conquered the multiverse. All right, so this is coming. Do we know what month is it coming? Yeah, March? Uh, March 2020. So next year. Next year. Next year. So uh, we'll have to we'll have to get the gear for this. We'll have to play this. Mm -hmm. right? Look at this. Look at this. All right. So you need a pretty beefy PC. Um, I core, or a, a core i5. So, oh, yeah, we got that. I was okay, gonna say, good. Worst case scenario, <laughs> I have two kidneys. <laughs> uh, right. So here's uh, yeah. So here's here's more information from Valve directly. It's a full story on par with major Half Life title, or is it episodic? Uh, it's a full thing. I can answer this. They said it. Uh, some guy said it took 15 hours to complete. So that's about the length of okay. the second game. I All wouldn't right. expect it to be super super long because of you know it being in, in VR right. and it being so detailed. Okay. This is probably the most detailed VR game I have ever seen. It is like incredible. Yeah, so it's not it's not exclusive. Uh, it is exclusive to VR, but not the Valve. Uh, oh, thank index. God! So it's playable on any VR headset. So you can do uh, the Vive, Oculus Rift. Um, yeah, so cool. All right, uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. Yeah, it is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. And I am pretty excited. All right, so we're gonna wrap it up. Yeah, All I'm right. going to go wrap it up, and then I'm going to go take screenshots from the trailer and print them on my wall and make a little shrine. That's... Like normal people do. Weird. All right. I never said it was normal.